Well, these are your front panel wires. This is the area they're going to go in. You have S lead. Uh, then you got the power. Got reset. Uh, you got H lead. Just that's hard drive lead. Uh, let's see, S lead, a system, system on. Uh, you have the speaker right there. Then you have PL, ED, P lead. I can't, I'm trying to remember uh, what that means. Power, there we go, power lead. Okay, and then all these, these all come from the, all come from the front panel. And so, most of these, you really you really can't get them in the wrong way because but some of them you you have to be careful like the reset it doesn't matter which way it goes there's no plus or minus so we'll do that one first get that one out of the way okay so reset sw which is reset switch so we'll look down here See if we can't find a reset. Okay, so it'd be since this is showing close to the bottom, well then it'd be these bottom two, bottom two right there. So reset will go on there. Reset. Take these two right there. Get my finger out of the way where you can see. Whoops, I'm on the wrong two. Uh, there we go. Okay. So, as you see, we have the reset. Okay, so that means we have a, a blank pin here. So the reset will line up with the, the reset on the board. Okay, let's see. Let's just grab another one here. Power, power switch above reset so it'll go directly above reset and if it uh, orange and white so it really doesn't matter which way it goes just so long you get it in the uh, get this turned around here a little bit okay it goes on the exact back two pins Okay, there we go. Got that one in there. H. Okay, this is hard drive lead. This shows you. This tells you when the hard drive is running. I mean, uh, when not when it's running, but when it's uh, looking for something, looking for a program or whatever. So we'll have to see. Some motherboards don't have these on there. If I can't get this thing turned around here just right. Oh, howdy. This is tough trying to. There we go. I'm trying to keep your fingers out of the way pushing these things on. Okay. All right, the next one. It says speaker. So now we got to look for the one that says speaker. Uh, oh, yeah, here it is at the very front. Okay. It shows to have a. Okay, it shows to have a plus and a negative. Well, in DC, anything black usually indicates ground. Or negative so we'll put the red at the front so we have speaker to speaker okay uh, we got that one on there that's your speaker Good. okay let's see if we've got a power lead here uh, yeah we got a power lead positive okay so the power lead positive okay goes on the Tell you what, let me take the speaker one off. We'll do the power lead first. Okay, here's P lead positive. So you have to look. These go to the uh, first one right there. That way, this is the the power lead, which lines up with the the plus there. Okay, see the. 
power lead and then it lines up with that plus there and then we put the other power lead on this one uh, it shows it goes on the third one so we skip one and come over one this will be for the now just because this has a white wire on it doesn't mean a thing because it's it's marked really well with a negative so all right negative to negative okay we got that one on there okay now we can put the speaker wire back on there okay there we go all right now we've got the front panel all wired up okay what else we got left here these are your USB cables I think and they're usually see it's got one pin that's covered over so it can only go one way so it doesn't matter which one you where you put it just make sure you get all the pins on there don't skip one Yeah, this one back here, this next one is on the yellow, red, and black. I says system fan. So if there's a spl slot for it, go ahead and put it in there. Okay, and then in the very back, this is your this is your front panel audio. In other words, this has probably got some uh, input buttons up here, so. Just plug that in where it says FP audio, which means front panel audio. And you got other things. There's one back here that nobody uses anymore. Well, some people do. This is a CD input off your CD drive. Okay, this is your earlier style power for your DVD and hard drives. This one are the new SATA power plug in plug ins okay now we're gonna put a we're gonna put us a hard drive in here I always want to make sure that the metal part is to the top because the bottom's got all this stuff and you don't want that to fill up full of full of dust and crap so make sure it goes down you can slide this in Whichever one you can get it in the easiest. Now, a good thing, a lot of people are constantly putting in, taking out hard drives. And I think the best thing to do is always put your, your main C drive in the very bottom one. Because when you, you've got these other slots that other hard drives can go in. Well, this way you can change them in and out, or you may want to put it at the top here and then use your other bottom ones to get them in and out because it depends on how much stuff you got on your motherboard to get the hard drives out easy or not. But in any case, you can do it any way you want to. Okay. Just to get started, just put one screw in there for now. Your SATA cable, look for number one. It's usually listed over here. If you look down in there, best you can. Alright, here we go. Let's see. We'll probably turn that off. It's got too much of it. There we go. Okay. Yeah, see, now you can see them. SATA 1, SATA 2, SATA 3, SATA 4. So, in this case, the top one is your number one. Okay, these will only go on one way because of this little L slot there. So you need to put it on the same way. It won't go the other way. All right, we got that in. Then we go to the back of the hard drive. Same way, it'll only go, one, well, let, let me hook the power one up first, since that's on the bottom anyway. Okay, take the cassette cable on the bottom, plug it in, cassette cable, go one way. Okay, we got those plugged in, 
And then of course we have our CD drive. Right here. I think got that on. Uh, got everything plugged in. Okay, we're ready to. We're pretty much ready to fire this thing up.